Yo, 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 yo. Welcome back to the channel, your boy Trucker B. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, comment down below. Don't be have, don't forget to turn on those post notifications. So let's get to it. I know it's been a minute. I don't know how long it's been. I just know it's been a minute. I've been on home time. I had my anniversary come up. That's right, my anniversary. Shout out to my beautiful wife, Tiana Baskin. Uh, we've been married for five years. Been together six. So you know. I was down in New Orleans on the anniversary. You know, we wanted to party and spice it up this year. We just wanted to party. And I was like, should I blog? Then I was like, nah, I'm having too much fun. So I didn't blog at all. But you know, you know what? I'm gonna drop a little bit of the videos from us partying in New Orleans. Boom, I'm gonna drop it. Let's get to it. Um, y'all today, man. They have the freight, it's just cheap freight. So you know how cheap freight is, you know. It just ain't paying for the miles. Like, honestly, the load I'm on now, I had today, had a thousand miles just to get the load. I dropped Thursday. I couldn't find an empty trailer nowhere within a hundred miles. I was at a Walmart distribution center. They didn't have any empty, so when they was unloading trailers, the quickest they were unloading, they was sticking them in another door so they can be loaded since they didn't have empties. So, you know, that caused a delay in my truck. So I had, you know, I had to, you know, put that mop piece down on, on one of the yard truck drivers and he finally took one out of a door and just told me to get it. And I ended up getting that one and I got up out of there. But yeah, I had a dead head a thousand miles, man, to get this load, man. This load paying like three bands and it's going like another 700 miles. So basically I'm getting three bands to go 1700 miles. So, you know, that's, that's almost, I want to say that's a dollar and like 70 some 70 some cent. I want to say, I don't know. You know, y'all can do the calculation. Y'all let me know down in the comment. Make sure you let me know down in the comment. So, you know, it's still a hustle. It's still hustling. You still got to hustle out here, honestly. You know, and I don't like the sugar code. I don't like the lie. And I don't want to lie to y'all, you know, telling y'all to come to Prime where it's greater. It's still greater now because they're better than, 80 to 90 percent of the other companies and what they're paying, but you know, you ain't gonna see that seven, eight thousand like I was seeing like late last year, mid last year. Like freight hadn't picked up yet, and it's steady going down. Honestly, like the, not freight, but the prices. So you know, um, you come to Prime, you gonna eat. You might just be eating bologna sandwich. You ain't, you ain't gonna eat steak. You might eat some baked chicken. You might snack on a bologna sandwich. Eat, eat, eat snake. I mean, eat, eat steak. And you snacking on um on a salmon, a black and salmon and then like that, you know, that how that that how I rate the money, you know. But you know how it is, man. I'm keeping it real with y'all, like, and these dispatchers, man, they'll lie to you, man. So you, you when you come to Prime, make sure you don't let a dispatcher, they'll call you and tell you to trust them. Now you're gonna put your trust into them the first time, and you're gonna see, man, they lied. Don't put your trust into them for a second or third time. If, you, if you're not comfortable or you feel like you ain't gonna make no money once you get to an area, just tell them, nah, I don't wanna send me something else. Cause I took a load from Tennessee to Ohio for 500 miles. They were paying like 15, like $1,600, $1,580. And I get over there, man, it ain't no freight. And he telling me I'm gonna have to sit over there on Monday and I dropped on a Thursday. I was like, oh, heck no, nah, man. Got on the phone with A, man. I could have stayed at home if I wanted to sit. I like, man, let let, let, let work something. Let, I'm, I'm trying to I'm trying to run my clock, man. So he had me dead head a thousand miles just so I can get a, a good paying load. So now I've, I've been I'm on I've only ran two loads. So now I'm gonna try to get me one more in before Wednesday. And um, you know, try to touch six thousand. You know, try to grow six thousand. Out the truck, no fuel costs. Try to bring home about 3,500, 3,000. I'm gonna say 2,800 to 3,500, anywhere in that range. You know, don't quote me, cause I might be wrong. You know, I'm just guessing, I'm estimating. But you know, um, man, it's slow, man. It's slow everywhere, man. I'm just letting y'all know, you come to Prime, you gonna still eat good. But don't be in my comments that man, I thought I was making seven, eight thousand. I'm letting you know right now, the freight is cheap. There's a lot of cheap freight out here, man. 
And now I compare the cheap freight to counterfeit money. It's, it's a lot of counterfeit money out here, man. Where it looks good on paper, but when you really look at it, you ain't making no money. So, you know, you got to be cautious out here, man. You know, I'm your boy, Trucker B. I believe in hustling. I'm still hustling. And I'm going to preach that to y'all. And I know, man, I know some truck drivers out there, man, looking at that freight. Knowing they got that big old payment because, you know, they want the lease purchase or they want the lease to lease their own a truck. Right now, I don't recommend you leasing their own no truck. Not with these freight. This freight. Man, just do you the lease purchase, man. Make sure it's a walk away lease. So when you turn in, don't go on your credit. You know, it don't hurt you from getting a job from somewhere else, man. Man, I'm just trying to get y'all the real, man. I'm just getting it to y'all as I get it, you know. And um, it's kind of jacked up out here now. But, yeah, I've been at the crib, man. I've been enjoying myself. I'm back out here. This is my first week back. And I can honestly tell y'all, from the time I took off to me coming back, the freight went from leveling out to back down. So this is what the freight looking like if you had to do a chart. So, you know, y'all be mindful of that, man. Make sure you learn your areas that you're going Tennessee, Kentucky, Ohio, stay away from those areas if possible. They may pay you to get in a little bit. They not going to pay you to get out. So I know I want y'all to be mindful of that, man. But till next time, man, this is your boy Trucker B checking out, man. Trucker B slash Rodeo B, man. I ain't got my hat on today, but you know, y'all know the vibe. But don't forget to like, share, subscribe, comment down below, get this post a thumbs up, turn those post notifications on so you'll be notified next time I upload a video. I'm going to be bringing y'all more content because I'm trying to catch up. It's been a minute. So I'm going to bring you more content. I'm going to bring you news. I'm going to bring you inside information as I get it. But until next time, y'all keep it real. I'm going to keep it real. Peace.